This is Joachim Gamble. We're back playing Catherine. Last time, uh, we're in the bar. We're gonna, uh, Vincent was cheating with a blonde girl whose hair stays perfect after having, um, sex. So we're gonna talk to Orlando with his really weird hat. Seriously, okay, man? They say men who cheat get cursed. Curse? That's so stupid, I can't even laugh at it. <laughs> the timing's too good. Still. I can't believe you cheated. Yeah, Vince. But if she's that cute a girl, maybe it's a lucky accident, huh? Um. Uh, let me see. I'm pretty in the middle, so let's say that's only if I get caught. Maybe. <laughs> well, good luck keeping it a secret. Bad or beg for her forgiveness. Never. This is something forgivable. Okay, well, let's see. Shows she's a more. Bit cold. Catherine's a good girl. She only beats you once you. every day. <laughs> That's she used to beat you twice a day. Thing about men who cheat being cursed. Apparently, it's related to those mysterious deaths. You mean, like how Paul died? Poor yeah. Polly boy. Or it is. This is getting called the woman's wrath. <laughs> Sounds like something Erica would like to have. Hey, Paul's been here a few times, right? Yeah, he was a classmate of ours back in high school. I ran into him just the other day. Seriously? Yeah, I no stabbed way. him in the back. That's why he's dead, man. I mean, uh, you didn't hear that. Maybe I should have paid more attention. Hey, it's not your fault, man. Hmm? Yeah. I it is it. your fault, Johnny Guitar. Every time I see that name, I just think of Fall and the Johnny Guitar song. Maybe if I talked to Paul more, this wouldn't have happened. Yeah, Johnny, this is all your fault. You're such a douchebag. You got mail. You will sometimes receive text messages on your phone. Push the triangle button to look at your phone. I'll look at them after I talk to Toby, man. And Catherine been together a long time, right? Yeah. What's it like in the beginning? I just want to know for real. Well, she beat me, like I said earlier. It wasn't anything special. It was at the reunion. He was giving her dating advice. Then he ended up falling for her himself, right? He ran to her side in the middle of the night when she was depressed, after all. Hey, stop that. Stand up guy like that turns out to be a cheater. You slam ball. Seriously. Okay. You're actually really sensitive, aren't you? You don't look it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, shut up. Shut up. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm looking at the phone. Okay, congratulations, blah, 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 yay. Are you at the SS? Straight sheep. Are you out drinking again? I came by your apartment today, but you weren't there. I want to talk to you about something, but I'll do it tomorrow. Oh yeah, your place is filthy. I told you, you have to empty the trash more often. I took it out this time, but start being more careful. Okay, that's all. Good night. Mm -hmm. That's my trash. Sorry, I wasn't home. Just bad timing, I guess. I can drink if I want. No, I'm gonna be good. Don't touch my stuff. <laughs> Sorry, I wasn't home. What do you want to talk about? We'll talk tomorrow. What do you want to talk about? You want to talk now? But you probably don't want to talk to me when I'm drunk. I think I know what you're gonna tell me. We'll talk now. That seems good. Yeah, that's that's good. Okie dokie, artichokey. Well, we're done talking to everyone at this table. Oh, didn't want to look up my phone. Oh, yeah, I keep bumping my mic when I'm trying to itch my nose. Okay, let's talk to these ladies. Would you like to speak to Lindsay? Would you like to speak to Martha? I don't care. <laughs> Please sit. Ugh, oh, it's kind of creepy. Have you ever heard this story before? The man who climbs the highest mountain gets his every wish granted. What's that? It said a man climbed that mountain 300 years ago and was given a fortune. It said a man climbed that mountain 700 years ago and was given the world. A man who climbs the mountain now will be given his future to do with as he pleases. Is this a fairy tale or something? These are true stories. The story of Rapunzel is based on this true story. A prince who was able to climb a very tall tower gained his princess. Now, what will you gain? Huh? Will you become the man of legend? I doubt it. Okay. Is this reaching you? Hey Vincent, if you get this, let me know, okay? If you do, I'll send you a picture. You know you want to see it. Who, who is this? Who is this? This is Vincent. Who is this? Do I know you? Don't message me again! Do I know you? Okay. I don't know who that was. Hmm. Very strange. Okay. Now you want to make sure you talk to people because some people in the dreams are actually here like... 
Hmm, this guy. And uh, hey, this uh, guy's hair looks familiar. Let's talk to him. When you talk to other customers, they may talk to you about their worries. Encourage them from time to time. Listen, Archie, you've got to become a better man. I don't know how you're ranking it, but I'm not desperate to climb the social ladder. Men are only acknowledged by their upward mobility. Don't be a tumbleweed. Be like Ivy. Always climbing. Always climbing. You look like the king from Fallout New Vegas. This is Todd, and the king of the men. Are you on your way home from the office? Or not? You're not wearing a suit. Suit? Oh, I don't have that kind of job. That's I just shame. oil a buff men. That's my job. Then? Vince's what job. We make business suits. Haven't you ever heard of Bantam suits? Have you heard the jingle? You'll be the cock of the walk in a Bantam. Ah, oh, oh, awesome. You're from Catherine's company. Hey. I think I've heard your voice before. Huh? Your voice does sound familiar. Your hair looks familiar too. I don't remember anything. Todd's a hard guy to forget. His hair looks like a rooster, doesn't it? That's enough cockadoodle reaction. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Uh. Wow. You're sharp. Okay, is more saying. Like I like my blankets, replaced by a maid every morning. That's kind of rude. What earth are you talking about? That's kind of rude, actually. And um, hey, this guy looks kind of familiar too. Legend, huh? If it's true, this customer is a journalist. He seems to be obsessing over a certain legend lately. A legend? I was originally. Of Zelda, perhaps? I can help you. I know where all the heart pieces are in Twilight Princess. Hmm. And Ocarina of Time. Have I met you somewhere? And Gavin knows where they all are in Wind Waker. He can help you. Think of it. Um, I'm sure I've seen you before. Oh, sorry. We were talking about the legend. Anyway, of Zelda. In my research, I found records indicating that similar cases occurred in hundred year cycles. Many men died last time as well. It's the truth. It's the oh. truth. Every hundred years, huh? I found a strange variation on this legend going around too. Hmm? There's a man who survives it. Survives the dreams? Very, very rarely. There's a man who is cursed but doesn't die. Isn't that interesting? It's said that the survivor is granted one wish. If he wished for eternal youth, he might still be around. <laughs> it's like a magic lamp. Well, if this is what you're coming up with, you have a wish in mind for yourself? Mm, to live forever? Is that too typical? Me? I'd wish for something different. Like what? I may wish to change the past. And make someone kill me. Oh, <laughs> that's a bit dark. I, wonder what I love I how Vincent doesn't even care. What would I wish for? Each time you sit and talk to people. I wouldn't want to be young forever, that's for sure. With the other bar patrons. Over time, the people and the conversation topics will change. You can go home at any time from the door in the front. Let's talk to Justin one more time. Puzzle game over there. Some stages are supposed to be impossible, but there are since you. I suck at that game. I think I'm pretty good at coming up with techniques. Uh, I think I'll go home for today. My head. See ya, toddy boy. Uh, let's talk to boss. I wonder if the woman's wrath her I heard about from Erica is real. She said that I was going to die somewhere along the line. Apparently, I have a wanting look to my eyes. Would I be cursed for unfaithfulness for this, too? I don't know. Still, she really rags on you, huh? Woman's dearest delight is to wound man's self-conceit. Uh, to wrangle words of a certain someone but tell me do i look vain or otherwise untoward i don't know but in erica's case it's i don't know thing. yeah i love that white suit Let's both avoid ending up cursed and dead sounds I'm good gonna head home excuse me bye justin baby quite a few customers come in to see erica it's great for me yeah there's nothing quite as attractive as a Ronald McDonald female. Can't hurt her anymore. Hey, hey, Vincent. We're all heading home. How about you? Hell no. Uh, well, I haven't drunk anything yet. Drink a little more. Actually, drinking in this game though is actually helpful. You, you actually do want to do that. So actually, I'm gonna make Vincent no, chug down a couple of drinks. There. <laughs> ah. Hurry up and come. Did, did I just... <laughs> that sounded wrong. What the? That voice. That voice. I 
That voice sounds so familiar. Why do I walk like I have a dump in my bed? Oh my gosh, it's a woman who never has her hair messed up during sex. Oh my gosh, hi, how are you doing? Yo, baby. Why are you here? So if I come here at this time of night, I can see you. Oh. You don't mind if I chug down like three drinks in front of you, do you? Hey, are you going home? Nope. It's not like that. I just had the fart. I just didn't want you to smell it. Sounds good! Drink it a do da, drink it a day. I'm gonna get hit wasted today. <sighs> One. When you drink, you can raise your intoxication level up to three times. How drunk Vincent gets corresponds to how fast he moves that night in his nightmare. Very helpful. <sighs> Takes three drinks to each to drink each um. Never cup. It in my life before. So you have to drink nine times before you have your intoxication level to the max. <sighs> Cheating, huh? It's not like I can just apologize for it and everything will be fine. Mm. No, I wouldn't know. <laughs> I'm just not talking to her, just like drinking. Really make Catherine happy? Oh my gosh, how big is this drink? <sighs> no use worrying about it now. Okay, this drink's never gonna end, apparently. <laughs> It's a bottomless drink. Okay, you can end now, drink. <sighs> Shit. I've never cheated in my life. I think Vince is just spitting the drink back. Okay, one more time and then we'll talk to this girl. <sighs> Cheating, huh? Okay, we already heard that. Let's talk to her. Hey, can't I come over? Is no, I have bad? laundry to do. Like this, I... Why are you acting all embarrassed? You wanna leave right now then? J just no. Alright. Okay. I got emails to check and hey, are you No, I'm not going yet. It's not like that. Oh. Ah, gosh, we've been at this bar for twelve minutes. Oh, Vince is pretty drunk. Look at him, he's like blah, 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 I can't walk right. Blah. Let's change the music so we can dance. To change the background music in the bar. Acquiring trophies will earn you more song. Try doing yeah, there's actually a trophy though where you um when you change the music. Let's try this. Uh, 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 dancing to the song even though it doesn't even sound right. Let's look at our mail. Ooh. Not tomorrow. Uh, can we meet for lunch? You don't need to reply to me now. Just meet me at the cafe. I'll be right there. Okay. Huh? What happened? Uh, okay. I'll try and make it. Well, uh, I'll go if I can. See you tomorrow then. Bye. See you tomorrow then. Okay. Good. I'm pretty good. Uh, so I need to do something good next time. Okay. Okay, let's, uh, we'll play Rapunzel, and then we're gonna go to the bathroom and probably start the next stage. I'm gonna play one stage, though, because I suck at Rapunzel. Play a video game. The rules are the same as the Nightmare stages. However, there is no time limit, but you do have a limited number of moves. If you use up all your moves, you will get a game over. So, take your time in solving a puzzle. I can't get past the fourth puzzle for some reason. You might be able to find new skills here. I hear this game is surprisingly deep, too. Surprisingly deep. I mean, I'm not very good at this game. For some reason, a man may weep upon his wedding day. Okay, Shakespeare. I like how it looks like you're looking at a glaring light. Oh, so it keeps all my stages I've done. Cool. We'll just do stage one, and then I'll just go ahead and leave. In a castle top floor, a trap beyond a locked door, lived Rapunzel, a, a maiden pure above the clouds in the air. Here from her old flowers with hair, as she cries tears of despair. Her sadness filled the skies, until, to her utter surprise, a noble young prince arrives. Blah, blah, it's like reading. With a loud voice, he declares, Rapunzel, let down your hair. I shall climb it as a star. Oh, my God. Oh, your highness, my dear. Oh, oh. Who's talking? Oh, your highness, my dear friend. I, I, that was the girl. Bring me threads of silk for eight nights, eight times, over sixty-four in total. Then I can knit a rope ladder and escape this tower. I suck at reading. Rapunzel, Rapunzel, I shall help you at all costs. Wait for me. Well, will anyone dare to approach Rapunzel on... I can't even read, it's kind of blurry. Or I just suck at reading. I'm gonna blame it's blurry, but it's probably because I suck at reading. So yeah, I'm not particularly good at this game, this one. 
Cause you, like they said, you only have a limited, um, spaces you can, um, do. You can't move around a ton. So you gotta, you gotta... It tells you how many, your power is how many times you can push. Booyah! How would that not, like, just hurt her? Whoa! Oh yeah, again down. You can also undo, too. So yeah, you also have an undo button here, too. But I just wanted to show you one stage. You know, you I think you guys get the gist, but... I'm not very good at this game. And I don't really know if there's anything you get out of it. I'm guessing you get, like, um, prizes or something, but I don't really care. I just wanted to show you that. I want to, you know, at least start maybe a brand new Nightmare stage. And beat it real quick. Get to the landing. Okay, let's exit. Life is like a puzzle without a solution. Yeah, Thomas Mutton. That remember that name. Remember that name. That's actually important later on. Okay, let's go in the bathroom real quick. Every time you go to the bathroom, you can actually see what the next boss is if you wash yourself. And all I didn't notice, but I got the booze on the side. I'm intoxicated all the way. Good. It's kind of weird. My TV kind of clips off at the end, so I can't see everything. Tonight you'll visit the torture chamber. Don't forget your boxers. <laughs> Shut up. Huh? But yeah, my TV's kind of weird. It kind of clips off the side. So I can't really see what's past there. So yeah, let's suck the air because then we're going to boogie out of here. Still, you're cheating? That's big news. Don't you care about Catherine? Not really. Of course, but I feel like I wasn't even involved with it. Well, you were. I hate to be so confrontational, but jeez. Men who cheat are cursed. If that rumor is real, what are you gonna do? Nothing because uh, it's not chop real. my balls off and become a woman? <laughs> Maybe that will solve the problem. If I don't I won't really be a man then, will I? Hey, are you Yes, I have stuff I have to do like to do. Uh oh. Well I'm glad I got to see you tonight. Yeah, whatever. Your... I will. Thank you. Have a blah 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 I can't think of anything. Okay, we're going home. To hopefully go to bed. Of course, that's not going to be fun because it's going to be more nightmares. Poor Vincent. Has to deal with nightmares and cheating and... Ooh, I can move the camera. He just drinks at home. Mmm, strawberry beer. It's just... My mother's been calling me up and asking how we're doing. Well, you don't want to marry your girlfriend? I don't just sleep around. I came here because I like you. You like me? Let's count sheep. To fall asleep. You don't even have a blanket on? Jeez, Vince. You really go bare and bone when you fall asleep, don't you? It's funny. I sleep on my side, so whenever I wake up, I'm always sore in the morning. But I can't sleep any other way. Third day. You've come. Tonight's area is the torture chamber. Where traitors are put to rest. Yay, torture chamber. We get introduced to a type of block. And I hate these blocks because I always forget they're there and I die. Especially when I'm trying to run from a boss. I forget they're there. The main course of the deadly climb begins here. Trap blocks activate when you step on them. Don't stop on top of them. Yeah, uh, they'll, they'll like kill you, so you, you activate them, then you run off them. Uh, or you go to the side, just don't yeah. stay on them or you would die. Ooh, that was painful, it's like the horse from Bayonetta. For the joy. Okay, let's get out of here. See, these are the blocks. Yeah, you gotta be careful. See, ooh, sheep stew. I'm falling! Ah! Ooh, this book is actually really helpful. It um kills all enemies on screen. So you wanna probably get that if you can. You can actually run through the uh, spikes. It's okay for some reason. Okay, nice. Oh, let's get these over here. Do 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 This game's got great music. Whoa! Thank you! They'll actually activate the spikes for you, which is very nice. Thank you! I love that scream. Woo! Right, I got it. 
Okay, so far so good. Move. Okay, the backwards stare thing. Oh god! Oh gosh! Who? that was pretty risky there. I was pretty- I was being pretty daring. Um, okay, how am I gonna get out? Oh, wait a minute, don't wanna do that. Push this block. There we go. Now I can do this. Booyah! Pretty easy. Okay, you escaped. Probably got a bronze or something. Ooh, a gold! Nice! I did go through that level pretty speedy. But that was just luck. But yeah. Okay, but you know what though? I think when Vince gets to landing, unless something happens, we're just gonna stop. Okay. You know what, this looks like a good place to stop, so we're going to talk to the sheep in the next part. So this is Minio Gamble. Thanks for watching. See you next time as we continue playing more Catherine. Okay, bye then.